I appreciate your support, your prayers, your love, your baby dust, your good vibes. It is lifting me up. You guys have no idea. I appreciate you so much. This journey is not for the faint of heart. What's up, fertility babe? Let's get these babies, ladies. Grand Rising. I almost forgot I was recording today that today is a vlog day because so we're going in for our mid cycle monitoring. So I've already done my yoga. I did five minutes. I ran my bath water. I just took my hair down. I'm getting ready to go chop up some mushrooms and get those going. Oh, and I lidocaine myself for <laughs> for my Lovenox injection. We did the last Lupron. Um, I put it on my stories on Instagram. Last Lupron, name it and claim it, was last night. So yeah, let me let me get going. Good morning, how are you? So let's just name it and claim it. Today, everything is gonna be clear. We want a good lining. Let's hope we got that 8.8 .8 like we did last time. It should be at least that because I think I've been, no, I definitely have been healthier food-wise, hydration wise etc and so let's get that 8.8 .8, try laminar um let's get that we the right side was fully quiet so it should still be quiet left side had a like one or two less than 10 hopefully that's quiet and um we get the green light <laughs> I have been keeping my spinach in a Ziploc freezer bag with a little paper towel at the bottom and I switch it out. I find that it stays fresher longer than leaving it in the bag that it came for. I have not been able to find any like loose spinach, which is my favorite. The thing about that I really don't like about the bags is it goes bad fast. So I'm finding this helps it last a little longer, not as long as like loose leaf, but I don't know, it gets mushy in the bottom of that bag. Anyway, let me get these eggs going and, oh, it's eight o'clock. Let's go, go, go. Que te espero para ti poderte amar. Okay. Yes. Okay, I'm alright. I'm on a call, but they can't hear us. Just so you know, there's. I'm I'm running late today. I'm so sorry. Work never ends. Like I got you. <laughs> it was a long weekend. Too, oh my god! So, yes. Know, to work and everything. <sighs> Um, I relaxed and I hung out with my puppies. The weather was so nice, so we went to the park a lot. What dog do you have? I have two Yorkies, two teacup Yorkies. Did they ever get lost in your house? No, oh my god. They're always following me around. <laughs> Even to the bathroom, I'm like, girls, girls. It's funny, my cousin got a teacup Yorkie, and one time they couldn't find her, and it was like chilling under the couch and stuff. Oh, really? Like it was the funniest thing. <laughs> The lining definitely has a triple stripe pattern. Mm -hmm. Let's see about five millimeters. Let's take a look at the ovaries. And this is a medicated cycle, correct? Yes, I've been doing Lupron and Estradiol, and also Lobnox from the reproductive immunologist, Lobnox Prednisone, and Plaquenil. Oh, wow, they got you on a bunch of good things, huh? <laughs> right side, you can see, is quiet. And left side seems wide as well. You said 5 or 5.5 .5 for the lining? Lining's 5. 5, okay. Yeah. So, Alright, so the review blow work and then I'll let you know next time. Okay, okay, thank you so all much. Right, Sorry I was late. Oh, you're completely fine. <laughs> all right. Hey, thank you. Alright. I am in a meeting. Let me take this out of my ear, but I think you guys heard that. It's 5. Lining is 5. Ovaries are quiet, so... 
I think we should be good. We might do today. We should be increasing the estrogen aisle, which I just realized I left at home, but it's okay. <sighs> Okay, so three times a day, morning, afternoon, evening, vaginally. Correct, that same little kilogram tablet inserted vaginally. Okay. We're going to see you back on Friday. If by Friday your lighting looks good, then we'll have you start the progesterone injections on Saturday, and then your transfer is going to be on the 15th, next week, Thursday with Dr. McConnell. Okay? On Thursday. Okay, so do I need to go in the portal and make the appointment for Friday then? Yes, yes. Make the appointment for the Friday. We're going to need to do both blood work and ultrasound. Okay? Okay. All right. Any questions for me? So basically the goal right now is focusing on increasing the line. Like what's the minimum? It needs to be like seven, eight? Around seven, yes. Around seven, eight. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is there anything I should be doing physically to help? Like exercise? I don't know. Acupuncture? No. Okay. <laughs> no. You can do acupuncture if you want, but whether or not you, you really, when you stop eating from medicine, that helps as well. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so you, you, you're going to stop that group on and we're going to increase the estrogen three times a day and usually that's enough to build to, to start building that line. Okay. okay, perfect. Thank you, Katrina. You're welcome. You're welcome. Any questions for me? No, that you've answered them all. Thank you. Okay, great. we'll see you back on Friday the 9th. Okay. And then hopefully all looks good. And I put you in on the schedule ready for the 15th with Dr. McConnell in Manhattan. Okay, but it's a tentative. If any reason we need to push back, we'll let you know. Okay, I mean, that helps because I need a chaperone because I'm taking the volume. So I'll just give her a heads up. Okay. Okay, thank you. All right, you're welcome. All right. Bye. 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 Okay, so there you go. I almost got worried about the five. And I was like, oh, there's Lupron. And last time I'd already ovulated. But it's trilaminar. I canceled my acupuncture for today. I'm going to do it next week. I'm just trying to figure out. Her prices went up. And again, I'm trying to not spend too much money. So anyway, I think that's good news. Vaginally, I left the pills at home. I'm going to have to do the other two when I get home. But I'm excited. I'm excited. All right. Yay! Hello, I'm home. Cheyenne just left. It is 7.41. Didn't take out anything for dinner. I totally forgot, but it's okay. I had a sandwich. I made her a waffle and some turkey bacon, and then she had carrots and cheese. And anyway, I did, I could have done better on my fruit today. I had one apple. I need to sit down. I mean, I need to lay down. I want to wash my face and lay down because I was up super early. I might do strawberries. And a little piece of the dark chocolate later on at 7.42. I want to be in bed by 9.30. I do this LED face mask. So when I say in bed by 9.30, I mean in bed with the face mask on. I do that for 20 minutes and then get ready to knock out by 10. <sighs> Today was a good day. I felt good. I just took my medication. I have to remember to pack the estradiol now and prednisone because I want to take it earlier. Well, the estradiol, I have to take it in the afternoon. Prednisone, I definitely want to take earlier. So, um, yeah, I'll throw them in my bag. <laughs> I'm in going into the office tomorrow and Thursday. So Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. All right. I, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. Maybe this will be the end of the vlog or maybe I'll count in... Let's do Friday a whole new day. Let's, let's make this the end of the vlog. I've been reading all your comments about the food. I'm glad you guys are eating well. I need the recipe. Somebody just sent me the thing that they do water with turmeric and ginger and something else. I need that recipe. So it's like, put it down below. I'm going to post it here. I need that recipe in my life. The infused water sounds bomb. And then I was thinking I can make infused water because I have the pitcher that I made the raspberry leaf tea, right? The teamy pitcher. I could do ginger in there, but I'm, I'm guessing you did like, did you boil the ginger and turmeric first? You put hot water over it? Or is it you're just putting it in there, like, obviously taking the skin off? Let me know. I'm very, very curious. Uh, curious. I was thinking I can go buy some turmeric root and ginger root and and um, let me know. I'm going to experiment because the videos are two weeks behind. But I'm let me know exactly what you do. 
because I want to try that. That sounded so good and so healthy, like lemon and turmeric. Great anti-inflammatories, both of those, right? So, oh my God. Oh my God. By the time you guys see this, if we're two weeks behind, I will already have had my transfer by the time you got, hopefully. Let's name it and claim it. Okay. Um, thank you for hanging out with me. I appreciate your support, your prayers, your love, your baby dust, your good vibes. It is lifting me up. You guys have no idea. I appreciate you so much. This journey is not for the faint of heart and you can't be a warrior by yourself. A warrior, you need a tribe and you guys are definitely my tribe. I have so much love and respect for you. Thank you. All right, baby dust to us all.